Hey everybody, Languages Lover here and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to make a review on my ninth SML book, which is Turkish, Le Turc, or Türkçe in Turkish. So stay tuned to find out what my thoughts are. And I also want to remind you to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, just to make me see that you actually like my videos. And if you want, Please share the, the channel, that'll get more people to see my videos, and I really appreciate you guys helping me with the subscribers and everything, so thank you guys so much in advance. Alright, so, Turkish, really, really interesting language. This one is very short, has, sorry, there we go, 71 lessons. Over here you can see this is a new edition. The Romanian one, for example, which is the one I'm going to do afterwards, is an old edition. And I'm not sure whether they renewed it or not. So you're going to see an old version. But I actually had other versions for my or this series. So yeah. And if you're like worrying that I'm always saying it will take you to AB2 levels, because not all of them are going to take you to AB2 levels. That, so I want to point that out at the beginning. So yeah. So here's the spine for Turkish. This one was more expensive. The, the, the early ones were $25, but this one was $30, so it's more expensive. Also has an E method. So let's see Turkish. And by the way, a lot of people ask me, do you think Turkish is hard? And I tend to respond that it's not hard, just logical. Yeah, here you can see a bit more of the Turkish language. In case you don't speak Turkish. But yeah, I really like Turkish, really interesting. I guess one of my main problems with Turkish is maybe the, the sentence structure and some pronunciation, I guess. But I really do like how Turkish is pronounced. Like, for example, say, how are you in Turkish? Say, nasılsın? And the U sound is like a, an I without a, a dot at the top. So, yeah, pretty like... Uh, I'm gonna see. It is pretty common in Turkish. Yeah, see? Here in Tanıdın. That's the, the I thing I was talking about. So, that's pretty awesome. So, nasılsın? Çok iyiyim. Teşekkürler. Yeah, I never expected to speak Turkish in this video, except for the Türkçe part. So, yeah, I don't speak Turkish that well, but it is a really nice language. With cases, as I just seen, accusative, and I guess it has a genitive too. I just want to see if it's mentioned. This is the 21st lesson, so I'm not guessing probably they mentioned it that, that soon, but yeah. Turkish is a very beautiful language. And if you're one of my friends and you're Turkish, what do you think of what you've seen so far in this video? Is is it like legit to learn Turkish? I really do think it's legit because SML has never let me down and I do like this method. So, And by the way, this also has a German edition. I don't know if the German one is get renewed, but... It does have a German edition, and it's called Turkish ohne Mühe, Turkish with ease. So, yeah, whether you speak French or German, and you really love Turkish, I guess ASML could be a good course for you. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you have, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, that'd be super awesome, amazing, and I will see you with my Limba Romana review. Bye!